for more on the stage remake of the play Shawshank Redemption in China. Actor Matt William Knowles joins me now from Beijing. He plays Hadley, the brutal captain of the prison guards in the Shawshank Redemption adaptation. Thank you so much for joining us. Thanks for having me. Well, how did the concept of an all-Western cast performing for this Asian audience come about? Well, I was um, contacted by uh, the producer um, through my agents, and um, they said that they were interested in talking, uh, the director was interested in talking about uh, doing the Shawshank Redemption in English. Uh, and it was his idea, um, our director Zhang Guoli, to use an entire um, non Chinese cast uh, for the film or for the for the play, um, which had never been done before, to have uh, a foreign cast speaking Chinese on uh, the stage. Now, do you actually speak? Did you speak Mandarin beforehand, and did you have to learn it? Talk to us about your process of trying to memorize lines in a foreign language. Absolutely, I spoke uh, Mandarin beforehand. Um, it was a requirement for this. Um, um, and learning, uh, for me, um, I still had to pour a lot of time and effort into this um, because uh, the director had such high standards for our Mandarin. He didn't just want us to sound like foreigners speaking Mandarin. He wanted us to sound completely local um, and completely clear and distinct on stage, um, you know, as much as a professional Chinese actor would on stage. So he had the, that was our level. We were, we were shooting for. So myself, I was constantly working on just refining things and, and to be uh, that, you know, little bit that, that's so hard to be, uh, to get localized and to sound completely perfect on stage, which is, it's, you know, it's a completely different thing than just everyday life. On stage, you really, really can, they can hear every little thing that you say so clearly. Um, and so you just have to be really perfect and you have to be really fluid and so we poured lots of time and effort right and it's not just the language because i mean i'm sure there are challenges of transforming a character uh not just in mandarin for the local audience but just the way that you move your body and the way that you um have to present yourself and the character a am i getting that right yeah i think there's a lot more to uh language than just uh what comes out of your mouth um when i was first learning chinese uh they told me that you don't learn the language you learn the culture um and i think that that's why someone just can't come in uh out of nowhere learn the language and and, and be you know localized you you have to learn how uh people move here you have to know how, how they joke how you know it's not just the words it's 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 a completely different you know i call it i call chinese just like a completely different uh from the core of the thought process it goes in a different direction from english so it's just as different as it can possibly be um and if you if, if you have lived here for a long time and been been immersed in the language for a long for a long time then you naturally kind of have these mannerisms and stuff. And, and so a lot of the work with this play was to try to transform a lot of my English, uh, you know, natural mannerisms or the way I would say certain things to the Chinese way of doing it. It wasn't just about the words. It's about complete localization of, of, of the, the rhythm of the, the being of the character. Right, and I just imagine that you're part of this rare group because not everyone has a language ability to, to do what you do, and we see all of you on stage. What is your plan and goal as an actor? Do you plan to stay in China and take keep taking projects there? Well, I'll take projects wherever I get the offer. Um, I'm sure I'll be working in China uh, to a certain extent for the rest of my life. Um, I, I, I enjoy working here and they treat me well. Um, I also do work um, in, in my home country in the US, uh, lived in LA for uh, several years and um, only came back here uh, because I just had so many offers of the last uh, two years. Um, so yeah, like I said, I do work everywhere. Matt William Knowles, thank you so much for sharing your time with us. We appreciate you joining us all the way from Beijing. Thank you.